have a good time. And really FNAF VR is a quirky little game full of fun surprises. Nice. I'm definitely too short. But despite that, it is still a very important game to the FNAF franchise, being the first VR game in the whole s And because I'm such a big FNAF fan, this game has been on my hit list to make a video about for a while. So without further ado, this is the FNAF Help Wanted Experience. It's two parts in service. Tar is out of tune and must be recalibrated. First, we must access his harmonization module located inside his secondary throat pipe. To access the throat pipe, both eyes must first be removed. Oh, yeah. You must be as precise as possible when removing the eyes from their respective sockets. First, firmly grip Bonnie's left eye and carefully remove it from its socket. You have access to Bonnie's harmonization module. Press the blinking button inside Bonnie's secondary throat pipe to enter calibration mode. Something is not right. One of those notes is out of tune. You may push the button again to replay the audio check. Press the colored button that corresponds to the incorrect note. Press the blinking button again to verify your work. Great job. There have been customer complaints about Chica's acrid smell. Sounds like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles from Chica's exterior and place it in the refuse bin on your right. Okay. Come here. Bam. Well done. Bam. Oh no. It looks like Chica needs another dose of the chemi spray. Do not let the infestation spread. Be sure to give the canister button another push as needed. Place the cupcake on the plate. Great job. Chica is ready to serve pizza and hugs to the kids again. Take a complimentary slice of pizza for a job well done. Delicious. See you next time. Okay. Back in the chair. Can. Welcome back to Parts and Service. It looks like one of our guests left a personal item on our star attraction. Now place the hat in the lost and found bin on your right. While we're at it, let's make sure there isn't anything else stuck inside. To access Freddy's chest cavity, well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the lost and found bin. Be careful not to touch any of Oh. It's just too bad. Crisis averted. Oh no. It looks like Foxy's proprietary servo motors are malfunctioning. It is recommended that you keep an eye on Foxy at all times. You will need Don't to worry, I'll shut them down. Fuses in the well done. The remaining chest fuses are located in drawers number two and number four. Fix both fuses to continue. Green, blue, blue. Bam. Red. Blue, green. It's in no eyes. Red, blue, green. <sighs> Good job. Retrieve Foxy's eye from drawer number three. When Foxy's eye patch is fully open. Place the eye back into his eye socket. You're the wrong one? Well done. <sighs> this concludes all your parts and service tasks. Pirate Cove can now be reopened. Okay. I'll wait till... I don't know, probably 69. 75, I'll wait till 75. No, I'll wait till 69. Hey, buddy. I'll wait till 50. No, oh, I, I hate you. 
A. You got caught. A. So Let me quickly explain why I hate plush babies so much. Um, they're annoying as hell to figure out where they are, their mechanics make no sense, and it takes forever to finish the minigame. Oh, I have to wait? I'm dead. Oh, yeah. Oh, my flashlight died. Hey, I think I got this. It was like, what, 3 a.m. maybe? What? No. Damn. What? What? Where were you? No! Oh jeez. No, 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 no. No! Oh, we were at like 4 a.m. Where, where do you come from? What? Oh, oh! See, I didn't even... Where? Like, can they appear to my right or something? Where? No, we took a step in there. Already done. Proof. Five a.m. baby, come on, please. I'm begging you. Come on, let me have this. No, let me have this, please. No, please, bro. Come on. No, no. I just kicked my fucking cord. I don't have the will to. To con I don't have the will to continue on. You can spawn up there? <laughs> no! It's literally 5 a.m. I did it! And now, after two hours of plush babies, I could move on to the last level in Dark Room. Jesus! Yo. Second, maybe third try. Oh. I like Mangle. Mangle then. I might need to stand. 
piss off. I think I'll do Pennard and then maybe I'll try FNAF 1. I don't know. I'm gonna save the FNAF games for last. Maybe I'll try Flush Babies. Okay. Boom. 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 Well Boom. You get away. Medical cord got trapped. Well done. Okay. I'm, I pressed the. I heard the wall, and I was like, close the door. I got this. What if I just sit here? to do this real quick oh so this guy's just explaining to me so immediately go to the left and hold the door closed and then just flash on it basically freddy will do the whatever and then bonbon bon immediately spawns in on the right so you hold the door on the left so bonbon bon never disappears and you hold till 4 a.m that's what he's saying it that, that's what he is saying Okay, a guy two months ago said that they did not patch it. Okay, so Freddy will kill you if you don't flash bomb it.
Corian. Let me go over there. Honda bag. Oh, did you put it in the So I've done the two hardest things in this game. No, no! Teleport. Whoa, whoa. Go, 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 leave, 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 leave. I tried to close the door! So what happened next might come as a little bit of a shock to you, but this actually happens to me all the time because um, I'm, I'm a dumbass. Uh, I paused my recording, and in my dumbassery, I didn't unpause it until I beaten the two next mini games. So that's uh, Nightmare On, which is the one I just showed you, and Circus Baby. So the Nightmare On one is literally what I just showed you just do the exact same thing and then just hope and the reason I'm not going to go back and replay these is because I don't care enough to um <laughs> no it's because I don't really have the time but basically Nightmare on is just exactly what I just showed you and then Circus Baby is you're inside of that same closet and every time Circus Baby looks at you you have to close the closet and then you have to open it before you get killed by... The, the fucking plush babies came back to kill me. But, you know. You have to close it and then you have to open it in time. I did it in one try. It's super easy. If you want to see how to do it, just look up Circus Baby FNAF Help Wanted 2 tutorial. Or something like that. It's really easy. Also, I uh, decided that I would not be playing FNAF 1, 2, and 3 in this whole video. Because... Really, um, they're just the exact same as the base game, except in VR, and they're also a little bit easier, because you can use the cameras and close your doors at the same time, and cameras pretty much don't use power. So, I'm just not going to play those in this video, because, quite frankly, it's a waste of your time, and it's a waste of my time. I have no idea how Nightmare Fader works. I think he works like Nightmare on. Forgot that I can't do that. Oh! There's literally an ad playing on the video that I'm trying to watch, bro. What the? F the TurboTax ad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flash the bed. Go to the door. Safety. Safety not! Okay. I don't know what I was trying to do. Whoa. Oh, his eyes. Okay, I need to look all around. Why am I still here? Wait, what? No, close the door. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. Oh, yippee! Arden Service is my favorite. It's definitely the coolest. Welcome back. Black light mode is a little bit confusing, so I'm gonna take a minute to talk about it a little bit. 
basically blacklight mode is where it's like every mini game, but it's either a different color, like or all this special rainbow stuff that you see on here, or it's like for the FNAF one two three, it's like the night five version. As in like the normal menu, you can see it's like night one, night two, night three, night four, and there's no night five. Well, that's what black light or indigo or whatever it's called, ultraviolet mode is called. I'm not even sure what the name is really. But you can turn it on or off using that little box with the red to green switch. I'll throw a picture of it up on screen. Uh, and that's what you used to change between them. But basically, it's like the final version of every single one. It's supposed to be harder, but for a lot of them, it's just the exact same minigame. So just like FNAF 1 through 3, uh, I'm just going to skip over all the ones that are just the exact same minigame as the original, just to save up some time, because this video is getting kind of long. So darker, I'm, I'm saving these for last. What? It said don't look behind you. I guess I'll look behind me and see if there's something there. Um, you, and then you, and then you, and then you. Close. Please? Yes. And now you're the one that's left. Okay, um, red, so it's that one. Then it is that one. Then it is that one, then it's that one. Piss off. I press on the button. Oh. I press on the button. I can barely do plush babies normally. Wow, that's hard. Cause they're all What huh? Where? It died again? Yeah, I, I will. I will die. Oh, uh... Yeah, no, we're dead. It was 5 a.m. That I basically won. I mean, like, I basically won. I don't care about the timer anymore. What, what, how much longer is left on the timer? Now, Funtime Foxy is replaced by a maze level, kind of, where you follow arrows, and then, depending on which arrows you follow, you get a different ending. Um, and to do that, you have to be every level, and I don't want to do the FNAF games just for the endings, so I'm going to do the outro now, or me in the past is going to do the outro now. Say bye-bye to him, because I'm never playing this again. I don't know, at some point I'll probably come back and finish it. We'll go to the prize counter real quick while I say the intro. Or, the outro. So, um... Thank you for watching. And uh, next time we'll do Dreadbear DLC, unless I don't do Dreadbear DLC. Honk, honk, honk. Yo. Okay, bye. Bye bye.